Hey, it's Michelle Nesky, the Posh PA, and today I'm gonna show you the money. We are gonna talk about the true cost of applying to PA school. But before I jump into it, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I'm here every week dropping new tips to help you get into PA school, but also become a successful student and a fulfilled practicing PA. PA. All right. All right, so let's talk about cash money. And factoring in the cost of PA school applications is essential in this process, depending on the number of schools you plan to apply to, as well as the fees associated with the centralized application called CASPA, okay? This expense can range anywhere from $600 to significantly more or significantly less, depending on what your plans are. Okay, so let's talk about the specific fees associated with applying through the centralized application system, CASPA. Now, the school, the application fee is $179 for the first school that you apply to and $56 for each additional program. Now, CASPA does offer a fee waiver assistance for that initial um, $179, but there are a limited number of waivers. And if you do get a waiver, you have to apply within two weeks. So something to really think about there. So if you think about the average person who applies, applies to about eight programs. That cost adds up quickly, including the initial application fee and the $56 for each one to $775. Now that's if you are applying to eight programs. But you also have to think about supplemental application fees. That is right. So a lot of programs use the centralized application service, but then make you fill out an additional supplemental application which are associated with fees. Those fees can be anywhere from $25 to $100. So let's take about an average of $55, right? So if you have eight programs with $55 worth of application, supplemental application fees, you can see how the cost starts incrementally growing, okay? So that is just for application fees in and of itself. Now let's talk about the other things you have to do, right? What about those standardized tests I talked about in one of my other videos, right? The GRE, the Casper, the PA CAT. Those costs can range from $99 up to $228, depending on which exam you have to take. Some will have to take multiple of these exams where the GRE costs over $200 and the Casper costs $100. So here we are with another couple hundred dollars of standardized test costs, right? So we are definitely well over a thousand dollars at this point, pushing 1500, right? Or more. So that doesn't even include, that's just the cost of the test. That doesn't include cost of test prep. Now the PA cat does offer some free resources, but GRE um, prep services are going to cost you a little bit of additional money. So you are going to have to think about that cost as well. Doesn't stop there, unfortunately, because Okay, if you're lucky enough to get an interview, which I hope that you do, a lot of programs are moving from virtual into in-person interviews again, which means travel cost. okay? So hopefully some of the programs are in your local area, but if you have to fly to an in-person interview, you now have to think about travel cost, not only flight costs, transportation costs, hotel costs, food costs while you're there. So, you know, think about these things when you are thinking of applying to 20 schools, right? So you have to think about the cost of all this because the cost of traveling to even one interview could probably be upwards of $1,000 or more based on flights and things like that. So just think about it when you're thinking about your number of programs, because here we are now in thousands of dollars, you know, of application uh, fees, standardized test fees, travel fees for interviews. Now, the good news is a lot of programs are still doing their interviews virtually, which can save you a lot of money on that end. Now, once you're accepted into a PA program, if you're still undergoing interviews, you are gonna wanna put down a seat deposit. You wanna take your seat if it's offered to you, right? That doesn't mean you have to stop interviewing at other programs. Maybe it does if it's your dream program, but it doesn't mean you have to stop. Now, seat deposits can be $500, they can be $1,000, okay? So it really depends on you know the program and how they structure that. But if you wanna hold your seat while you continue to uh, interview at other programs, that is often non-refundable and will cost you somewhere between 500 
and a thousand dollars. So really something to consider there as well. Um, now let's talk about this. Many people spend years preparing their applications only to have them thrown out because of errors during the admissions process, right? So a lot of people are investing in pre-PA services, such as the ones that I offer, which can add additional costs. But I will tell you that if you devote the time and a little bit of your budget to doing this right with some help, it will save you money in the long run. And budgeting is one thing I really like to talk to people about as I am going through you know, their application journey. So pre-PA services can range anywhere from $40 to $300, depending on what you're looking at. Are you looking for personal statement review, a mock interview, a CASPER review? Obviously, there are many services out there like this. So um, it's really important to think about if you want to invest in that piece as well. So now we have all of these costs together, and it's really important to think about each one of these things as you are moving and planning into your application cycle, right? So I can also help you help recommend finding alternative streams of income that can help balance, you know, this out. I, you know, there are a lot of things that I can talk about with you um, to try to you know, obviously you're probably working to get clinical experience and earn that income, but there are also additional income streams that you might want to think about um, while applying to PA school to help you reduce costs without a substantial amount of time. So I love to help and I offer consulting services at a variety of price points to fit any budget. And you can contact me directly or book a session on my website at michellenesky.com. I always love working with students, not only to help them pick the programs that are the best, you know, for them that are going to have the highest yield of an interview and an acceptance, but also think about that cost and really budgeting appropriately. So hit me up on social media at michelle at michelle.theposhpa, sorry, or at michellenesky.com.